Hey, so I wanted to show you how you can use Domo AI to create some really unique videos. So let's get started. So Domo AI is a new tool that allows you to turn videos into other types of videos. It's really cool, really unique. So what you're going to do is you're gonna to go to Domo AI. I'll put the link down below. And like similar tools like Pika Labs and Midjourney, you have to use Domo inside of Discord. So you wanna make sure you have a Discord account. And if you don't, just click on start in Discord and you can create your account. But also if you already have a Discord account, you still want to click start in discord because that is how you're going to get started so if you click on start in discord it's going to prompt you to accept it and it's going to push you into the account or into the server so you'll see here that i have the server open and of course feel free to read everything that you can do within the server but really all you need to do is go into the use demo category and just click on generate one two three four and then you'll be able to start using domo so all you have to do is do the slash command and you'll see here that there are different things that you can use so you can turn an image into a video just like pika labs and just like runway you can also turn words into art which is really cool you can turn anime into a real photo but what i like to do is slash a video so turn video into another video feel free to try out the other options that you can use but this is really, really cool. So what you can do is you wanna open up a video. So I already filmed a video from my phone, so I'm just gonna open that up, but feel free to, you know, shoot on your DSLR or shoot on your phone like I did. And then you give it a prompt. So if you scroll up here, I find the best way to like do anything in AI or like you, when you're using a new AI tool is to go up and see what other people are doing. So you can actually find out how to actually use the tool the correct way. So I'll just scroll up here, you'll see that this guy turned an image into an anime, but let's look for some videos. So I'm gonna scroll up and just see if anyone has done something really, really cool that I can emulate, but also just to see what people are doing, right? It's very interesting to me anyway, where you can just literally scroll up and just find something. It looks like this one's cool. So I'll say, anime so i'll put i'll just put anime because i like that and then once you do that it's going to give you some additional options so you can select the different type of anime style that you want so we have flat color japanese anime live anime style there's paintings there's 3d cartoon style comic style so i'm going to put comic style just because i think that's pretty cool and you can also decide on if you want it to be three seconds five seconds or ten seconds i'm going to do three seconds because i tried five seconds before and it was super long it, it says seven minutes but it's really like 15 so keep that in mind and i'm also gonna just gonna click on refer to source video you can also do refer to the prompt more but i'm just gonna do refer the source video more and then keep my anime prompt here so let's click on start and then it's going to start the process of turning that video into an anime style video and i'll be right back in a moment okay so it's done so let's take a look so this is the original video here hey in my studio and I'm going to use this as an opportunity to test Domo. So it's not going to play that whole video because I only selected it, but this uh, is very interesting because it looks like I have bigger lips than I do. <laughs> also, my mustache is very interesting, but it's, you know, it's AI. It's it's funny. So let's press play and see what happens. Hey, I'm in my studio and I'm going to use Pretty cool. And what we can do is use other AI tools to, you know, match the synchronization between what I'm saying and the lips of the image on Domo. So I want to showcase that because it is a cool AI tool and you can make some really unique clips with this particular AI tool. So that's it for this short. I'll see you in the next one.